Driving with Elliott Sadler here in the 19 car. Now Elliott in the crash. Turn two. Oh, and nowhere for Tony Stewart to go. And you see there's nowhere goodness. for Denny Hamlin. They just keep wrecking over here. This is normal product of Dover Raceway. The, the, the concrete canyon. You can just get locked up there and can't do anything. As you come up out of turn two, the, the groove funnels, and one car gets sideways, there's nowhere to go. But you wouldn't believe the amount of banking over there, Mike, that just leads you right to that inside wall, right where the 88 car is. Elliot Sadler was the first car around. Tony Stewart, Denny Hamlin, Kevin Harvick, Dale Earnhardt Jr., here's Scott Riggs. A lot of key contenders. And there's Elliot climbing out. Yeah, I know at least three cars that are in the top eight points right there, Harvick, Hamlin, and Earnhardt. Harvick trying to fire it up, move away. Stewart will get what's left of his Home Depot Toyota back to pit road. Now you see Sadler out of his car. Foundation is going to auction off the hood of that car. It's a little more crumpled than it was at the start of the day. Let's see if we can get a look and see what happened here, guys. Goes Elliott there in the 19 car. He comes down the hill. Oh, right in the front of David Gilliland. Get another look at it, but I didn't and see that David Gilliland did anything wrong. He was right on the bottom of the racetrack. Oh my Whoa, gosh. So Hamlin Lillian. came flying in there. Absolutely. Bill Elliott, the 21. You know, when you come under that, when you come out of turn two back there, Mike, under that bridge, down low, it's pretty hard for the spotters to see that point on the racetrack. See the 19 go up the hill. Here comes Tony, and he says, oh, man, please go down. Please go down. Well, look at Casey Kane in that nine. He actually got some damage on the rear. The 15's the one that done a whale of a job. Darrell, we've always said this is a self-cleaning racetrack, and I think most drivers coming through turn two expected Sadler and everyone else to, right. to just slide to the bottom, and they didn't. I agree. Take it through in slow motion. See, Carl got loose right there. So did Joey. Joey's, Joey's got out. Loose. Yeah, Carl never touched he him right there. Him. No, he never did. Wow. He never. He thinks he did, but he didn't. Yeah. No, he never touched him. So when they see the video, but look what happens behind. Eric Almarola does not escape this one this time in the 88. Yeah, so many good like cars this involved Bliss. there. Yeah, had a great run all day. Going by on the outside, great trainer there. And she lost about 10 spots. Oh, we got trouble coming off of two already. Matt Kenseth is around a hard hit. Kenseth took a hard hit. Oh, oh and the car's on the head. Donnie Nuremberg in 52 goes tumbling down the backstretch and then in the inside wall. Sauter involved in it. And that, the thing about this racetrack, it's we like, are destroyed. It's like a pinball. John got much damage, but. Here, all these, gar these cars, they see what's happening. The 21 gets turned. Michael Jeff Waltrip Burton. into the wall. Yep. That backstretch, when they start wrecking back there, man, it is just, it's tough. Because a car can bounce in front of you just like it did Johnny Sauter. You see Sauter down there on the low side. I mean, it's just got nowhere to go. You can't get away from a wreck on the backstretch. And we heard Sauter say on his radio, we are destroyed. And there's, he's right, they are hurt badly. Jeremy Mayfield, oh, trouble is Blaney. Michael Waltrip and Blaney got together. There goes Blaney into the wall. There goes everybody. Yeah, Brian Newman's in it, Greg Bimple. 48 car. Half the field, it looks like. And the ninth caution of the day will be huge. 40, 41, 31, 0. Well, the leader restarts in the middle of the pack. 
this is frequently the result. Yeah, it's kind of like, oh, I almost bet you that this something like this might have happened. Now, Tony Stewart, a lot of those cars, Michael Waltrip, Dale Earnhardt Jr., Matt Kenseth, they will be back on the lead lap. Looks like every car has driven away except for Greg Biffle, Jimmy Johnson, and Dave Blaney. Johnson had a car that might have won it. And Mayfield, who was the leader, is now wrecked. And the field is being held in the front straightaway. Here's what happened. Oh, it's three. They're just three wide down through there. And Blaney's trying to give the guy on the inside of room, and he got into Michael. There you see Greg Biffle Boy, to the back of Jimmy Did you see Johnson. the nine car shoot through there? Hard to believe. Wow, I can't believe he made it. Matt Kenseth got through. Ward Burton stopped with minimal damage. Mark Martin stopped. Let's see, they go three wide, and Blaney tries to move over to give uh, the 22 car some room, and him and he and Michael come together. Daryl, I wouldn't want to be at the team meeting Monday at Bill Davis Racing because it was Scott Wimmer who trying to come up the track to get an entry into turn three caused Blaney to swerve to the right. Here they come down the back, and they get three wide. Way. My mistake. It's just uh, too many cars going in the same spot. Jeremy Mayfield, the 19, finally gets out of that mud over there. He's coming down pit road right over. Mark Martin up on that steering wheel trying to reel in Edwards. Whoa, off the wall, the two car burst. Bush, and his teammate comes across. Oh, man, that was two for one. Both Penske cars taking out that one. A in melee, Jimmy Johnson also gets tagged. The reigning series champion, Jeff Green, the 66 cars in it. JJ Yaley. Tell you what happened here a moment ago. Now watch the two car left side of your screen up off the wall. Looks he had, like he, yeah, he had a flat tire or something. He had something broke or a flat tire. Yeah, I couldn't tell if the tire was flat in or if he just got up so high out of the groove and the car wouldn't turn. He got up in it again. I mean, only Kurt would know. But uh, boy, when he hit that wall, bounced across, it just really took out everybody. 66 Jeff Green, Casey Kane. There's the 18 car again uh, from high above. Watch the contact there. Newman goes up down and gets the inside wall. Kane has nowhere to go. Right in front of him is the two car. The five car, Kyle Busch bouncing off a couple. It's like Tony Stewart just avoids these guys. I think he got a little bit of contact, maybe some damage. Jeff Green on board camera. And you, you just can't see with all that smoke. Jeff did the best job he could, but just cleared three or four of them just about the time the smoke cleared he was into it. Glenn Boyer on board. Come on, everybody get down low. Straight through. Come on, baby. There you go. And, that's and, what I'm talking about. And now that's the way to do it right there. He just saw that one coming at him. He stabbed that throttle and sped back up and barely missed him. This crash, Kurt Busch over. There's Newman's car coming across. A ricochet, two X in it. Casey Kane in it. Jimmy Johnson with contact. Jeff Green, the 10 of Riggs. 41 of Riggs Thornton. On board with Casey Kane. He's going to have Kurt Busch come right across in front of it. There. Boom. Hello. You've raced all day long, you've cleared all the wrecks, and with 14 to go, you're in it. That's a heartbreaker. They pile up back straight away. Oh my gosh. Looks like 10 cars in it. There's Tony Stewart, one Montoya, the 42. There's so much carnage, I can't tell who all is in it. Both the BK cars, there's Landon Castle. There's Scott you just saw Speed Travis the, Quapple, Scott Speed, the 79. Smoke car. Tony Stewart, who did not have a great qualifying run. Restarted toward the back. Montoya's in it. Oh, they make contact right there, and that's a no-no. Uh, Jeff Hammond just standing over there in that very spot, saying, you know, you got to really watch turn two. It's treacherous. By golly, he was right. Reagan gets by. Regan Smith spinning. Montoya down into the wall with Gilliland. And now watch this next group coming in. Here's where it starts. Remember, Jeff said these banks are self-cleaning. Everything slides to the bottom. But somebody turned Michael McDowell, and there's another pile of cars in it. 
talked about it before the race. Things just happen so fast here at this one mile racetrack. You're coming out of that corner, Mike, at 150 miles an hour. And right, even when the spotter's hollering at you, way back there where you see that 78 car get sideways, you just can't slow down. Uh, actually, it was a Scott Speed's car. Stewart went up the track and they make contact. Yeah, plenty of room right here. Everything looks fine. You see uh, Landon maybe comes down a little bit and Tony's pushing up. You can see Tony's got the wheels turn hard, pretty hard left, but he makes contact with the left rear of the 83 car and it's on from there. Regan Smith can't slow down. His momentum carries him into Tony. And now the track is blocked. Nowhere to go. And, and you see these guys, you see the tires smoking, and you, you see them trying to slow down. But you can't stop a race car on a dime when you're going 150 miles an hour. Up to 79, Bam. Scott Speed, yellow number on the roof. He piles into Castle. And he gets tagged by Stephen Light and Joan Nemechek. Whoa! Whoa. No, Johnson's Johnson. Johnson. out of it. Can't go. Big wreck going to happen oh, here on the front no, street. man. You are wow. kidding me. Oh. Pretty well blocked. So here's the restart. It's a Watch nice the 48 jump. here. Yeah, he starts to go, but it looks like when he That's shifts. That's where he shifted third. Third, and it just didn't, something happened. And then, then here comes on. trouble. It's on from there. Look who this takes out the 78, the four. 47, all these cars piling in there, nowhere to go. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Bam, be, right into the 24. Matt, or, um, Kyle Busch. It's gonna be easier to tell you who's not involved. <laughs> Goodness yeah, right. gracious. The two, the The California kid versus the seven time champion. Green flag. Larson did not get the start that he wanted. He's going to have to work hard to get the outside of Jimmy Johnson here. Oh, McMurray three wide. Wow, he's sideways. Oh, no, 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 no. The crash. Just got straight away. Crashed. That'll be it. Big wreck going into three. I mean, look at him. A wreck in everywhere. I think they made it to the overtime line. Now NASCAR will have to look at video to determine whether the leader was at the overtime line or not before the caution. So many good cars that were having great days here, all wadded up in the third turn. Almendinger destroyed Dillon against the turn three wall. What a shame. Jones comes down pit road completely wrecked. Casey Kane. Cars just walked down. He just watered up the 77s. Cripple going down pit road here with the whole nose caved in. Watch Ty Dillon. He gets loose. Then a little bit of contact mm. between he and his teammate Ryan Newman. Hard contact, 77 and the 13 there. And then it's on. Yep. And he gets into the one. Oh. Is that McMurray down there? McMurray. Bain. 